Saturday night's game between the Yankees and Red Sox had incredible moments, wild, weird moments, and it was a great game, momentum back and forth. Go check out the the recap, the condensed game if you want. This is a breakdown of one of the cool moments that happened in the top of the second inning, and this breakdown is brought to you by T-Mobile, the exclusive 5G innovation partner of Major League Baseball. So we got a one-two pitch to Oswaldo Cabrera. He takes it. It's an inside fastball. He throws it over the deep, but short wall. Abreu comes down with it. Did he? Did he? The glove is empty. Pitcher's like, did you catch it? Is it a home run? What's going on? He scratches his head. He looks around. Ball's not in there. Walks off sadly. Kid's in shock. He shakes his head like, nah. Home run, says the ump, who kind of looked like Roger Clemens for a second. Oswaldo Cabrera is excited. And Abreu's not. Scratches his head, touches his ear. That's probably where he got hit. Hurts. It was a great play. It was a hell of an effort. These kids are pumping each other up. Even though it's a home run that gives the Yankees the lead, it it was an awesome moment, and they were right there. Oh, I mean, we had jaws dropped, smiles stuck. The guy behind him isn't wearing his glove. Brought his glove to the stadium, not wearing it. So he's trying to get his glove on as it's coming. He does end up with the ball, so I guess... He's all good. People behind are reaching like they're going to help. It's a great grab, but then smashes into the seats. Now, the dude in the Obey shirt, that was his seat. And then the kid there, they like got up and slid over. They got out of the way. Good for them, I guess. The ball's in his glove this whole time. And his glove hits the elbow of the guy who brought a glove, which spins it and then hits his belly. So that spins the glove from being up and then he hits his wrist on that dude's belly. That spins it down. He gives the Obey dude a nice kick. Boom, right in the back. And the kid, he has his hat out, which allows uh, Abreu's bare hand on his left hand not to get banged up. So the kid's being a hero. And then he just smashes his ear on the back of the seat, and the glove got spun upside down, which probably loosened it, and it's out. And look at his eyes right there. You can see Abreu's eyes just being like, oh, shit. And he's going to look in his glove, not find it. A lot of funny reactions here because the lady in the Red Sox shirt behind Obey, she just goes, oh, Jesus. The old lady does a classic old lady. Oh, like just a classic old lady pose. The little kid's mouth on the right. Watch him. Oh, dad, look who's in our seat. Just like pure wonder. That's awesome. And then the dude in the jersey, he comes up feeling the guy's glove. He's like, hey, is the ball in there? I really want a ball. Is it in there? Can I have it? Just touching the glove, checking. Eventually, he's going to grab it and celebrate. What a scene. Here's a different angle where this angle, what I like, is that the guy in the bullpen, the security guard, he sees it. He's like, oh, I got to get out there. He goes to jump the wall, realizes I'm not jumping that fence. And then is going to run around. He's going to come all the way around. Boom. There he is. Look at that. There he was. Oh, should I jump? No, go around and use the door. Do what you're trained to do. Goes around, offers help. Quick. Great job by the Fenway security guard in the bullpen. I like this moment where Abreu looks at his glove. Oh, shit. Not there. It wasn't there. And then you got Affleck and Damon in the booth because they were promoting the movie. Oh, did he catch it? And then they scramble to the monitors because they need to see what happened. They can't figure it out. Just a great moment where you had a great defensive play, then a quirky baseball fence wall botches it for him. And, you know, I love the crowd stuff. I've been on vacation this past week. Just a little PSA. I've been on vacation this past week. A ton of breakdown stuff, a ton of ejections, wacky stuff happened. They'll be coming out in due time. So if you you want to subscribe, if you haven't subscribed, more coming out. I'm going to try to catch up with everything I do. Also, the trade deadline is happening right now. So JM Baseball, Talking Baseball, Baseball Today, John Boy Media, all of our baseball coverage is going to go crazy and have fun with that. And like I said at the beginning, this breakdown is brought to you by T-Mobile, the exclusive 5G innovation partner of Major League Baseball. T-Mobile is using the power of 5G to make your baseball experience better than ever. Check it out at T-Mobile.com slash MLB.